Chronic heart disease is the leading cause of death in the U.S. And for years, doctors recommend older adults take a daily aspirin as a preventative measure. But now medical guidelines have changed a little bit on daily aspirin use. The reason experts say taking one a day will not necessarily keep a heart attack away. Every 33 seconds, someone in the U.S. dies from heart disease. In those patients, it was, it's always been assumed that aspirin is beneficial and it's widely recommended. Aspirin's blood thinning capabilities stop blood clots from forming, preventing a clot from blocking a vessel in your heart or brain and causing a heart attack or stroke. But two large multi-center trials, the ARRIVE trial and the ASPRI trial, found that aspirin did not decrease the risk for a second heart attack or stroke for patients who already had one. It did, however, increase the risk for major bleeding. Aspirin uh, is associated with bleeding. That's oftentimes in the form of gastrointestinal bleeding. Also, there were deaths attributed to aspirin use in the ASPRI trial. Experts say the risks outweigh the benefits when it comes to daily aspirin use. But despite doctors not recommending a daily aspirin for patients older than 60 with no known heart issues, about a third of adults 60 and older take aspirin when they shouldn't. That's more than 18 million people. If they said take it every six hours, that's what I did. I didn't even think about it. I just took more. So who would benefit from taking a daily aspirin? The Mayo Clinic says if you are between 40 and 59 years old with a high risk for a first-time heart attack or stroke within the next 10 years, the benefits of taking aspirin still outweigh the risks. All right, keep this note, though. If you are currently taking aspirin every single day, it is so important to talk with your doctor before you just abruptly stop. Terminating a daily aspirin regimen suddenly might trigger a blood clot, and that could lead to a heart attack. So talk with your doctor and make that decision together.